How did the ancient Egyptians build the pyramids? Over 4,500 years ago, without cranes or trucks, they stacked massive stone blocks into perfect pyramids. Here are the top five scientific theories that may explain the mystery. Number five, giant ramps. Many scientists think huge ramps were used. Blocks dragged up straight, zigzag, or wrapping ramps. Simple in concept, but required massive amounts of material. Number four, hidden internal ramps. Architect Jean-Pierre Houdin proposed spiral ramps inside. This let workers pull blocks up safely from within. Simulations show it is possible, but evidence is limited. Number three, sledges and wet sand. Carvings show workers dragging statues and blocks. Scientists discovered wet sand cut friction in half. This made blocks much easier to move across the desert. Number two, waterways and boats. The Nile was the key to moving heavy stones. Stones floated on rafts and through canals to Giza. At the site, ramps and sledges finished the job. Number one, water lifts. A newer theory suggests Egyptians used water channels. Hydraulic systems may have lifted stones with buoyancy. Evidence exists, but many experts still debate this idea. Maybe the truth is a mix of all these methods. What do you think really built the pyramids? Comment below and do not forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. See you next time.